right there, this man, I'm Jafar, okay? I am the new Grand Vizier. So, I've been putting it off more and more and more these past 24 hours about this video. Um, okay, I don't know if it's that I'm not excited. I don't know if it's that I'm burnt out on Aladdin trailers. Um, just after that first one, because that was mentally exhausting. Um, it's just, I don't know. I'm feeling like I'm not really interested. Uh, I'm, I'm sort of interested, but I guess I'm just tired. I, I don't know. I'm trying to figure out my feelings as I'm making this video. <laughs> so, uh, what we're going to do is we're going to watch the trailer. Um, of course, it's going to be cut up. So, if you were expecting the full, full trailer, you wild. Um, <laughs> so... Um, and then I'm going to give my thoughts on it. Obviously, a lot of you guys know 100% um, already what I'm going to say right off the bat. Um, and I just... Man, this is going to be something. This is going to be something. They're over there! Get the... The feet! You three get back there! Okay, I'm going to go ahead and stop it right here. I'm going to let you already know, this music kind of slaps. Okay? This is kind of this is kind of dope. Look at my man's looking like the Prince of Persia, bro. Who this man? Who this man Aladdin think he is? You stumbled upon him. Okay. Um. Now I don't want to be that guy or anything, but the dude they have playing as Jafar. When I first did a video about it, and I was like, "Yo, this guy looks like he'll make a good Jafar." I fucking lied. <laughs> I absolutely <laughs> lied. This guy is, um, he's not Jafar. He's not Jafar at all. He's not Jafar or even close to Jafar. Um, I can make you rich. Rich enough to impress a princess. Ooh. There's a cave of wonders. Bring me mm. the lamp. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead. There's a few things here. Um, what the fuck is Princess Jasmine's tiger's name? Why do I want to say Shere Khan, but Shere Khan is from Jungle Book? What is wrong with me? Raja. Oh, it's Raja. How I forget Raja, baby. How I forget my boy. Listen, listen. My man's hat is on oof right now. Look at. There's nothing wrong with this. This is what I would imagine the live action Aladdin would look like. But it's just something about this guy that's not so far from this trailer. Obviously, trailers are completely different. Just like how when we saw the first trailer, we were like, uh, I don't know about this. It's the same thing with this trailer with me. Like, theatrically speaking, it's a great trailer. It's put together really well. But, like, holy crap, they do not do this, like, hardly anybody justice in here except for Will Smith. But w w whatever. We, we Just play, play the tape. You rich. Rich enough to impress a princess. There's a cave of wonders. My man's staff, though. Bro, look at this staff. Look at it. First of all, let me show y'all something. Let me. I'll be right back. So if anybody ever wants to be like, Jay, you not a fan of Aladdin. I've had this since I was like four years old, bro. Four or five. I've had this. And so, obviously, it don't really work because I took the batteries out because, you know, they were, like, calcifying in here. Yeah, nah, batteries wouldn't even, they wouldn't even work in this thing. So, anyway, I remember my dad took, my, my parents actually took me to see Aladdin on Ice, right? I think it was Aladdin on Ice or there was, like, a bunch of stuff I've seen, like, Disney on Ice. And I remember my dad buying me this. And like when you pull the, when, there's like a trigger right here, right? So you pull the trigger and the eyes are supposed to light up. Look at this shit, bro. This is a staff. This is what the staff should look like. That right there, this man, I'm Jafar, okay? I am the new Grand Vizier, all right? I don't know who this nigga think he is, but uh, uh, you ain't me, bro. You, you tripping. So anyway, uh, this is probably my, this is the only prized possession that I have. Um, I probably have like maybe two or three other ones, but you know, just so you know, your boy not playing around. Bring me the lamp. Now, before we go any further, okay, the problem I have so far with this guy playing Jafar 
is he doesn't capture the 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 feeling of Jafar of that like kind of like soft yet sinister but charming type of nature that Jafar has and hopefully this guy in the movie does a really good job but so far in this trailer they are not showing his best like highlights at all oh okay now this is the part of the trailer I've been waiting for specifically for Genie and I know I keep pausing it guys but listen I, it's for a reason trust me on this okay so now I do want to say before before we talk about Genie before we talk about Genie obviously rest in peace Robin Williams but I honestly could not imagine anybody playing Genie other than maybe Will Smith and Pro like Jim Carrey like that's it like those are the only two goofballs I could ever see as genie but i just want to say you know beforehand this is a completely different genie this is this is not a like shot for shot remake of the original movie this is not supposed to be the same robin williams genie that is that is a different that is a classic okay even will himself has come out and said you know what these are big shoes to fill but they're not my shoes to fill like you know Robin had his spin on the character and now it's my turn and like I, I want to do that justice while also paying homage to the original genie and Robin Williams. So I just want to say like that that is like the most important that thing that I get out before we talk about genie. So Oh great one who summons me. I stand by my <laughs> word. loyalty to wishes three. Okay. All right, seeing Will Smith talk like this, pretty, pretty fucking hilarious, bro. Look at this man's face. <laughs> I just, I think it's really good. It's good. It's better than the first trailer we saw. Loyalty to wishes three. I'm kidding. Watch this. Oh my God. Yo. <laughs> I'm kidding. Watch this. This is, this is great. This looks fine. I'm okay with this. Because before it just looked like Will Smith as a deep fake and he was like, his face was casted over this like CG character. Now it looks a little bit better. It looks, it looks blended a little bit better. Um, I don't like, uh, it's n there's, not, there's nothing really I don't like, honestly. So. Watch out. Uh, you done wound me up. You ain't never had a friend like me. Can we watch this one more time? I'm, sp I'm actually speechless. I don't have nothing to say. I don't have She's nothing to say, crazy. nothing to hate on. I'm kidding. Watch this. Okay. Now, uh, I was just about to say something good, but all of a sudden I stopped on this frame. Okay, so let's just look at Genie's face real quick. You see how his face looks like it's positioned one way, but the rest of his head is like warped on the right side right there? Like, I don't understand why his face is like that. Like, it doesn't, it doesn't line up right. Like, it's just, it's not okay. I am digging this trailer. Hey, can you make me a prince? There is a what? lot of gray area in make me a prince. I could just make you a prince. Oh, no. Y'all see my palace? You look like a prince. Okay, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no. Y'all see my palace? So, this is very interesting. This is very, very interesting. I don't I don't you understand like this particular frame. On the outside. But I didn't change anything on the inside. Showtime. Okay, I have to say, Will Smith <laughs> dressed in Arabian garb is is just amazing. I, I just I dig it, but it's also super funny. But this goatee, my boy, the goatee, what is, what is this? No, I'm in charge, okay? I say when it's time. Really? <laughs> I thought a princess could go anywhere. Not this princess. Do you trust me? Don't you dare. Oh my lord. I am actually on the brink of tears, my guys! Oh my l Yo, okay. Anybody that knows me knows I I just love everything Disney. 
there's there's literally like <laughs> there's only so many things that like make me shiver to my core and this song is one of them the other is make a man out of you from mulan that's another one and then there's like four from hercules like listen anyway so the, the reason why i stopped at this time is because i actually physically had to stop watching it because i think i'm gonna cry like it is it is that significant like oh man but i want to see her dad i want to see the sultan Hold it together. Is this? His staff is red. Is this where he becomes a genie? No, 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 no. This is after his second wish where he becomes the most powerful sorcerer in the world. That's that's the only way to recite that. That's, I'm sorry, guys. Wow. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm I'm excited now. I don't know I don't know what to say. I there's no way that it has all of the components I would want a live action Aladdin to have. It has all of the major scenes that I want it to have so far. Except what's with this giant Iago? What's going on here? Let's just go ahead and wrap this up, fam. Let's just go ahead and wrap this up right now because I've I've done enough talking and I've done enough cutting and stuff and now it's time to get real. It's time to get serious. I I liked The Jungle Book when that came out. Obviously, in my last two Aladdin videos, I've talked about The Jungle Book very extensively. I've talked about Mowgli. I've talked about uh, Dumbo coming out. I've talked about all of these Disney live actions, the Tarzan ones that came out, which we don't really talk about, uh, which we definitely shouldn't because there was absolutely no Phil Collins in that, and that was, that was a bummer. Um, but I think if there was a movie that needs to be done properly it's this one and the lion king now i've said this time and time again where i'm just like oh well hollywood's doing you know doing stuff that i don't think i've ever been so invested in a movie in such a long time um so i definitely want to see the <sighs> this is why this is so important i can't even articulate the things that i'm trying to say right now because they are so important to me so personally this is going to affect me a lot this is my childhood this is one of my like top three favorite disney movies and the reason why i'm just so serious about this one is because the jungle book was so good like when you watch the original movie and then you watch the live action remake they're two different movies and so that's what makes them special is it the live action one is not a shot for shot remake of the other one now i'm hoping that aladdin kind of does the same thing where it takes the basic premise and ideas of the original and then flips them around and morphs them into this great story that is just told over a course of two hours so I, I personally am very, very invested in this. I will probably actually, like, be f in physical pain if this movie is bad. Like, I just, I don't think you guys understand. I don't put, I don't invest a whole lot of my time or energy in a lot of stuff. It's another thing for me to invest emotionally into stuff. And I have to say, I'm emotionally invested in this movie. So, hopefully, this comes out great. Hopefully, Lion King comes out great. Um, but I want to know you guys' thoughts. Let me know down in the comment section below. I know a lot of you guys are varying ages, like, uh, my boy Dimension. This probably means something to him, um, you know, and all of my older, you know, audience and stuff like that. People around my age in particular, I know we're, we're probably going to feel some type of way. Um, but, you know, obviously to a younger audience who watched Aladdin when they were either a little bit older or you know like way too young to even like comprehend like this is this is 1992 okay like my my parents <laughs> when when I was like super young this was one of the first movies that I ever experienced ever I ever got to see it was this it was Hercules it was Aladdin it was uh Lion King like these are those are my probably most likely, yeah, my, those are my top three. Like, I've never been able to place my top five favorite Disney movies because there's ten in the top five. But in the top three, those three are definitely it. And so, 
I just have a very, very special place in my heart for this movie, and I really, really hope it does amazing. And I'm, I'm very excited to see Will Smith in it. Um, Will Smith is probably one of my favorite, just people in general that exist at all. Period. So, um, I'm definitely excited to see more of him as Genie. I, I know he's not gonna, he's not gonna ruin anything. I hope that this is not one of those Disney live action weird like once i just i really hope this is great so but anyway once again i i want to hear what you guys have to say down in the comment section below let's have a conversation let's talk about it if if i feel like i get enough of these and if it's interesting enough we'll probably address it in a whole nother video yeah we'll probably do that but uh once again let me know your thoughts give this video a like subscribe to the channel if you guys are new this has been your boy jay sama and i will catch you guys next time y'all know keep that shit canon